Hello there, I'm Chef Johnny. This is Texas Style Barbecue and Cuisine. Today, cooking up something for Thanksgiving. I'm going to show you how we're going to cook up a turkey. We're going to be hanging this in my drum smoker, the barrel house cooker I have. And so I'm going to show you how to hang a turkey, get that cooked up for your Thanksgiving meal. So stick around. We've got a Got a turkey just from, uh, picked this up at the HEB uh, last night. And the thing about this is, some people will brine their turkeys and everything, what you have to realize, most of these turkeys have been brined. If you look right here along the bottom, it says injected with the solution. It's already been injected. But let's get it out of the package. Let me show you what we're gonna do. First thing I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take the giblets out. If you'll turn it around where the neck is, there's a bag up in there. Get your giblet bag out. That's gonna have your heart, your liver and your gizzard up in the front of this turkey in the neck. Get that bag out, we'll use that to make our gravy. Then the neck is back here in the cavity in the back. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pop this little holder off. You can cook it with that on there. Doesn't hurt a thing, but we're gonna pull out the neck. Pull the neck out. You see it's still got a little ice on this bird's still a little bit frozen. So first thing I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take my seasoning, and this is just my basic chicken rub. I'll put the recipe down below, y'all be able to see it, but I'm just gonna take my shaker and I'm gonna shake plenty of rub on the inside. And since we're gonna hang this one, I'm gonna put my uh, device to hang it in. Y'all see this? Right here, this is what goes in and hangs your, hangs your bird in. So I'm gonna hang it with the dark meat down, the legs down. I'm gonna just slide this up through my turkey. Now turn it around here. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take some onion. You still can put uh, your aromatics in here. Just cause you're hanging it doesn't mean you have to omit aromatics. Aromatics are in, put the carrot in. It's just onion, carrots, and celery. And what I'm gonna do now is, I'm gonna hook these legs back that we took out a while ago. So that leg's hooked. Come over here, make sure this leg is hooked. So now when I hang my bird up, it'll all stay together. And it won't drop out the bottom. Your juices will drip out, land on your coals. It's gonna give you some nice flavor back up on it. But this bird's gonna stay together. The only thing we have to worry about are these wings. So what I'm gonna do is, is uh, I'm gonna take these wings and I'm just gonna tuck them. One here, tuck it in the back, right here where y'all can see it. Take this wing, fold it, and tuck it there. So, bird's ready to go. Now let's get some seasoning on it. It's about a 14 pound bird, so it's gonna cook up real nice. We wanna make sure we get plenty of seasoning on it, because there's just a lot of meat to season up. Season this side. Now this bird's ready to go. We're not gonna cook this until tomorrow. So early in the morning, we're gonna get them on. This one's ready. It's gonna get hung up tomorrow in the uh, barrel house cooker. So we're gonna get it in the refrigerator and I'll get back with y'all tomorrow morning. Time to get our whole bird on. See if Nia can help me here. It's seasoned nice. I had to take the uh, H brace out because it won't fit through the holes. So you got it there, Mia? Yeah. I got it now? Bird's hanging, getting closed up. Oops, gotta put the thermometer back in. Track our fit temp. We do have a gauge, but those digital ones work good also. So we got it in, gonna let it go up to 165 in the breast. We'll see what happens. Turkey's up to 165 in the breast. That's where we're wanting it. It's looking pretty, so let's get this thing off of there. Again, we got to pick the H brace up and bring it out with the uh, with the bird. There we go. Bird's been sitting out for a little while, and uh, 
It's cooled down some, but I'll tell you what, it still is pretty hot, but we're gonna take it off the stand. This bird is plenty warm. I'm gonna unhook the little plastic guard back here that holds the legs together. Take out some of our aromatics. And we're gonna see if we can cut this bird a little bit. Now, we're just gonna take the legs off of here. Cut right there. This other side. I bet you that leg's gonna break off pretty easy. Man. It's still pretty warm. It's been sitting for a while, but the bird's warm. This bird is gonna be plenty moist. That's pretty. We can get this one off. Pop that leg joint out. Now we can cut it off. Two legs are real pretty. Now, take these breasts off. Take this breast, I'm just gonna cut right down by the kill bone. Start trimming this breast right off the bone. Tell you what, it is still hot. That right there. Beautiful, moist turkey breast. Come in here. Right there is my joint for my wings. We're going to take the wing and all off when we take this breast off. That breast. So again, cut right down by the kill bone. And just start shaving that breast right off of the carcass. I'm trying to keep my bone and knife right on the bone. Like I said, even though this one's been off a while, it is still hot down inside. I tell you what, what do you say? Beautiful turkey, the barrel house cooker. Did a great job of cooking that whole bird. It'd be a wonderful presentation bird. Y'all seen me do some halves. I like to cut them in half. They cook a lot faster, a lot more evenly. But when you want to do a whole bird, had a pretty presentation, this definitely was that bird. But a uh, little mesquite in there with some uh, regular charcoal. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna come in here and cut off a little of this white meat. I could tell while I go in the pictures that this was very moist and just a beautiful, beautiful bird. Now, one thing that might be a great thing to do right now is if you've never subscribed my channel, run down there and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell. That way you know every time I put up a new video, we put up videos weekly. You're always going to see a video on Tuesday mornings, 9 o'clock Central Time. I put out a new video and then uh, usually on Saturdays, I'll get up another one. Back teaching at the college again, it's hard to get out that Saturday one, but Tuesday morning, definitely, you'll see those then. But it's a beautiful, beautiful bird. Uh, nice smoke ring, plenty of smoke on it, good color, moist. I'm gonna get a little taste of it and let y'all know how it turned out. Hmm. Right, that's good, try some of the skin. That's just an excellent bird, I tell you what. Um, I've never been disappointed using that barrel house cooker, ugly drum smoker, whatever you want to use, barrel cookers cook fantastic. Cookers. So it's a great video, hope you enjoyed it, tastes fantastic, and uh, we're going to enjoy this for supper tonight, but thanks for stopping by Texas Style Barbecue and Cuisine, always do appreciate it, and we're going to see you all down the road. How them boys put food away beats all I've ever seen.